name's Donna, I'm a junior, and I'm 16 years old, and I am Muslim. Islam. It, I don't know how to describe it. It's a combination of Christianity, but another religion, yeah. but it's, um, I don't know, it's just, you don't want to define it's, Islam, it's just, I believe in God, and the Quran, and what it says, and there are traditions that go with it, and it's super, uh, it's liberal, it's not as conservative as people believe, and I follow my life after it. Religion means um, something that you live your life. you strive to be, your morals are all based on it. Seeing that it, um, that it guides the decisions that I make personally, it has a big impact on my life. And especially in America, it's predominantly Christian, so it's differing from other students, but yeah, it's just I don't know. I mean, that's only because I'm like really vocal about my opinions and they know not to mess with me, but that's just me. I, I can't speak for Donna. So yeah, same. I mean, not really. My friends are really understanding and they are very respectful. Yeah. I think so. that also goes with the fact that we're in AGS and our community is like super tolerant and open to questions and being curious and. Yeah. Oh, of course. Of course. Being in America, where the minority is like not Christian, uh, you'll be offended either way. Someone will say something, and it'll just not make sense, and you'll you won't know where they got that from. But you just explain in a courteous way and yeah, educate. Oh, I'm completely tolerant of other religions. Like I, completely open. I will constantly ask my friends of other religions, like what they believe, um, why they believe a certain way, and how it relates to their religion, and, yeah. Yeah, um, I'm always questioning about other religions, just because curiosity, and vice versa, they're always curious about my religion, and I don't mind asking or answering any questions, so. Oh, of course. I mean, anywhere you go, there's going to be religious inequality, or people who, uh, are afraid of the unknown and are afraid of asking questions, I guess, and afraid of the not norm. Does that make sense? Yeah. Um, I think it's probably like one of the worst things because honestly, religion, if you follow it and it's your belief, it should be a personal thing that you go through in your life and you follow in your life. Like it doesn't matter what people think and it shouldn't matter if you believe a certain way and it's different to someone else's. So I just, I don't see a point in being intolerant towards people other than your religious religion. Time. Okay, I hope it'll end, or I hope it will end for sure. Um, I don't think it will end, but I do believe that um, Education is a big thing. People are asking more questions and people are um, understanding people's differences and all that stuff. Um, I know that the community I'll be living in will for sure be supportive of like religions in general. Like you won't see me living in like the south of Alabama, but I'll I'll be living in like a liberal, you know, community because I know that they'll understand where I'm coming from. Definitely that, like terrorists or stuff like that, but I mean, I don't take it too offensive because I know they're joking and they know they just get that from the media and stuff, but yeah, that's what I hear. Um, <clears throat> that we're terrorists, that we hate Christians, that we hate America. I don't know. That's basically They assume that whatever happens in the Middle East is like what happens 
wherever you are, if you're Muslim. You know? Like the crisis and conflicts that happen in the Middle East, like that's how we portray ourselves as. Even though we're, we're not. Just that we're super negative, I guess. Yeah. That like you see the media and them blasting crazy people yelling on TV, and that, like that's us. When those are legitimately just crazy people, and that's not everyone. Not at all. That's it.